Hello, my name is Grace. Today, I'm going to read the Bible story. Um, it is the wonderful story. And from now, we will start the New Testament. There's many chapters. Today we will read first chapter. You just came to us. Luke 2, Matthew 1. The angel said, Mary, God will give you a son. Mary was very surprised. Mary didn't... Mary... Mary didn't marry. And... Yeah, <laughs> Mary, she didn't marry, and one day God said from the angel, you will have a son. Joseph, Mary is pregnant. God sent the baby to save his people, said Gabriel, the angel. I am sorry, but there is no room in my house. There were so many people in Bethlehem. All of the inns were full. My wife is about to have a baby. She and the baby will be in danger if we cannot find a room. Please help us, said Joseph. They were gone to Bethlehem for one check. Mm. So Mary and Joseph has also gone to Bethlehem and they're full with the people. I don't have any room left but you are welcome to sleep in a stable. Mary and Joseph has to stay with the animals in the stable that night. So, the house people, they were full of people, so there were no room. But that person said, there's one stable. Um, you're we welcome to stay in there. Mary gave birth to a lovely baby boy. Jesus, the Savior, was born. Mary wrapped it, the little baby Jesus in stripe of clothes the gentle leg him in a manger manger is where with big place with big plate of horse horse eat from the manger so they cannot go anywhere and everywhere is full of people so they have have gone to the stable and stayed and the baby jesus has born in the stable hmm. let's call him jesus said Joseph, there is a question. Actually, I have made it. I have made it. He has born in a stable because God want to Jesus to understand the poor people. Okay, it is a fact. He has born in the stable because God 
wanted to do just to understand the poor people. Not like if he have more in the great palace, think the poor people are like, please give me some, and he will be like, I am taller than you. I am very rich, and he, they, you just can will not under able to understand the poor peoples. This baby is the son of God," said Mary. The angel said, "Angel said so to Mary." Mary and Joseph said, "This baby can came to the world to love us." He came to help us love God. Jesus is the Son of God, right? Yes, actually, from the New Testament, I will do one thing. I will translate like in the Korean language. So in one by one. In one time, I will read one story, not two three stories. Okay, I will translate in the Korean language and tell you in Korean language. From now, uh, it is I will speak in Korean language. <laughs> 어, 네, 지금부터 제가 한국어로 번역을 할 거예요. 네. 예수님이 우리에게 오셨어요가 제목이에요. 천사가 메리, 마리아에게 말했어요. 하나님이 너에게 아기를 주실 거야. 하고 마리아는 너무 너무 놀랐어요. 왜냐면 마리아는 결혼을 안 했거든요. 천사가 요셉한테 말했어요. 어, 아 죄송해요. 제가 한국어로 번역을 안한 지가 오래돼가지고 마리아는 하나님의 아이 어 하나 하고 그 아이가 이 세상 사람들을 구해줄 구원해 줄 거야 마리아가 그런 아이를 낳을 거야 그리고 그렇게 가 가브리엘 천사가 말했어요. 어, 어떤 뭐 텍스트, 책은 뭐 그런 거에 관해서 이제 체크를 해야 돼서 검사를 하려고 이제 모든 베들레헴 사람들을 모이게 했어요. 하고 거의 많은 모든 집 주인들이 어 여기 자리 없어요 다른 거 가보세요 라고 말했어요 너는 마지막으로 찾아갔지요 여기도 방이 없어요 죄송해요 어, 모든 집들은 사람들로 가득했어요 어제 와이프가 제 아내가 아기를 낳으려고 해요. 지금 방을 못 구하면 음, 아내의 아기랑 아기와 아내가 위험해요. 제발 도와주세요. 라고 요셉이 말했어요. 어 저는 지금 집에 자리가 없지만 마국가는 자리가 있어요. 여기서라도 주무실 수 있으면 주무셔도 돼요. 그래서 어쩔 수 없이 마리아와 요셉은 마, 
중국간에서 자게 됐어요. 마리아는 예수님을 낳았어요. 마곡간에서 마리아는 예수님을 낳았어요. 마리아는 예수님을 조그마한 옷으로 감쌌어요. 그리고 잠시만요. 그리고 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 잠시만요. 말구요의 어, 감싼 다음 말구요의 이렇게 어, 놔두었어요. 아, 뭐라고 해야 돼요? 하고 요셉이 말했어요. 우리 이 아이를 예수님이라고 불러요. 이 아이는 하나님의 아들이에요. 마리아가 말했어요. 그리고 천사가 마리아에게 알려주었어요. 마리아랑 조셉이 말했어요. 이 아이는 우리를 사랑하기 위해 왔어요. 우리를 하나님께 더 가까이 해주기 위해서 오셨어요. 네. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? And next time we'll read number two chapter. The shepherd heard angels singing. Look to. 네, 오늘은 여기까지고요. 다음번에는 The Shepherds Heard Angels Singing 이라는 제목으로 제가 읽어드릴게요. 그러면 안녕! Bye!